running to the home today. Uh, I can't do it. Wait for me, wait for me! <laughs> you see, you see, it's just going to look, in your video now, it's just going to look like I'm slow and I'm holding it. Look, look. Yeah. <laughs> Hello everybody, so today I'm off on a wild camp and uh, heading off into the Lake District once again uh, down to the Langdale Valley and we're going to be camping on Side Pike this evening, that's the plan anyway. Um, but today's going to be a little bit different because I'm meeting up with uh, Chris Gooch uh, as I've mentioned in my previous video, Chris has got his own YouTube channel, does landscape photography and also a little bit of travel photography as well. Uh, so yeah, it's going to be quite good, really looking forward to this one. Um, it's always nice when you go um, camping with like-minded people, so you know, I'm really, really excited about this. So I'm just going to head off and go and pick Chris up now, so um, I shall see you when I get there. YouTube, meet Chris. Oh, yes. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's uh, let's get set off. Langdale Valley, here we come. One day it's over, baby. Someday we'll find a way out. When all our strings are broken, you'll see that we could do without. When all our dreams are over, when all our hopes are dead. With this town turning colder, with all our colors bleeding red. A big rink of when the storms are hit. I sing you any song you want to hear. Cause you, you turn ashes 
Okay, so Chris and I are finally up the top and just pan round. Chris is just over there. I don't know if you can see him. He's over there somewhere, but he's just up there um, taking some images up there. Uh, so we've come up. Um, we were potentially going to uh, kind of camp on side pike, but I mean, that's that just down there. Uh, there. And yeah, there wasn't really much place to camp up there and it was really rocky so it had been hard trying to get the tent pegs in and stuff so we've come up a bit further so just down there is um, Lingmortan so that's just down there and uh, so we've come up here and looks like we've got some better views up here uh, so yeah we can kind of look down in towards the Langdale Valley from there and then back around here more if you stand on up there you're kind of like looking out towards Windermere and and that direction so yeah looks like a a really really lovely evening so i'm set up with my first composition uh and i'm just using the valley floor as it s is round using that as a nice little bit of a leading line and then we've got the langdale pikes in the view as well and we had some really lovely streams of light just coming down, uh, coming across and, and that haze, although it's hazy, which, you know, kind of works in your favor, but it kind of doesn't. But this, this scenario, it, it has, you know, so you're picking out the streams of light that were just coming across there. So it looked really, really nice. Now, as you can see, we're almost shooting in directly into the sun there. So it's quite harsh. So what I've had to do is I've, double stacked my filters so there is two grad filters in there 1.6 and another one is a 0.9 both soft edge and then I've also got uh, my polarizer on the front there too um, and I'll just show you the difference that uh, the filters the nd filters make just cutting out that light you know just to pull that detail back there's not really much there but there is some great color you know could have done with the odd few clouds or something that would have that would have been really really nice and would have probably made the image so but yeah looking really good so so that's my first image um the lights kind of really faded now so it probably might be my only one we still haven't set up camp yet so uh we'll see uh, but a really, really good image to start.
why first aid kits are handy, people. <laughs> show, show us here what you've done. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> So one at the start already, and then that one. Very accident prone today. <coughs> don't know what's going on. Yeah, so I don't think Pete's usually like this, but um, today he seems to want to do himself a serious injury. <laughs> this is the second time in, well, not very long. About an hour. About an hour, yeah, that you've cut yourself. So, so uh, Chris, he's struggling. <laughs> <laughs> it's the back that's above problem, not me. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, mate, well, I, I think I'm gonna have a problem though. We've woken up to this absolutely superb scene this morning. Uh, we've got a little bit of mist just down there in the valley and it really, really adds to the image. Did you get some good images, Chris? I think so, I've just been viewing them back now and yeah, I'm pretty happy with them. I'm usually quite hard on myself and I'm always like, ah, oh, these are rubbish, but no, I'm, I'm quite happy on this occasion. I think I think we've been blessed by the conditions this yeah. morning, I think it's been... Yeah, it's beautiful, been really nice. Really, really good.